Here's a Samsung Galaxy S6 tip for you. I'm going to show you how to use this thing called Flipboard. So right here from my home screen, if I swipe over to the left, it brings me into Flipboard. Now, if this is your first smart device or you've never used Flipboard before, this might be a little invasive to you. You don't know what this really is, so you need to figure out what it is to you. This is where you're going to find some curation of articles. So tap the top right hand corner, and this is where I can receive articles for news, business, technology. I have sports, celebrity, science, entertainment, style, food, and travel. So these are all the different categories that I can get related articles on. And I can also come into some deep customization options. So for news, if I tap on more, I can get news from the Middle East, healthcare, Supreme Court, government, environment, Congress, Republicans. So tap on these little tags here, and it's going to bring more of those relevant news related articles up to the forefront of the news category. Tap less and it's going to hide that. And I can do that for each category that I want to show up inside of Flipboard. And I can even rearrange them. Maybe I want technology up at the top. I want to tap in there. I want some apps, mobile, and social media. So tap all that down. So now this is going to, when I come back out into the Flipboard menu, refresh and show me what's relevant. I can also disable notifications or enable notifications for Flipboard. And if I wanted to, I can actually use the Flipboard app. We'll come back to that in a second. So now I'll come back out into the Flipboard and it's going to refresh and you see purple technology, red news, the gray is business, we have sports for blue, and I can keep swiping down and I see all these articles. So now if I tap on this article here, it's going to flip it out in a nice little animation and show me the entire article where I can read it right here on this screen. Now we'll go ahead and come back out and we can come in, we'll swipe down to refresh, it's going to refresh all the articles. And what I'm going to do now is tap on the settings icon. You see Get Flipboard. If I tap on that, I can get a dedicated Flipboard app in the Google Play Store. Now, why would I want to do this if I have Flipboard enabled on my device by default? Well, let me show you something. We'll come back out to the home screen. I'll tap and hold in an empty area. And I'm going to swipe over. See, this is a Flipboard screen, but there's a check mark above it. If I tap on that check mark, it's actually going to gray out the Flipboard, and I'll come home, and now notice if I swipe over to the left, no more Flipboard. But if I come into the Google Play Store, I can install the Flipboard app separately, so I can still use Flipboard, but it's just not going to be constantly running in the background on that side screen from the home screen. So that can come in real handy if you're using Flipboard and if you like the interface and you like everything that it does, but you just don't want it to be a constant screen in your home screen. But you can always come back in here, tap that check mark, and have Flipboard run again. So that's really convenient in how to use Flipboard on your Samsung Galaxy S6.